The urgent manhunt near Los Angeles tonight after two sheriff's deputies were ambushed. And tonight here, the new surveillance now emerging, showing the female deputy applying a tourniquet to her partner, calling for help despite being shot herself. Here's our chief national correspondent, Matt Guppin, tonight. Tonight, new security camera footage capturing this female L.A. County sheriff's deputy shot through the jaw, but tending to her partner, himself shot in the forehead, protecting him by placing him behind that pillar and radioing for help. She's calling for help, but she's having a hard time because she can't speak very well. Moments earlier, a lone gunman approaching their cruiser, firing multiple times, fleeing on foot. The deputies, a 31-year-old mother of a 6-year-old and a 24-year-old man, were sworn in only 14 months ago. They were rushed to the hospital where a small group of protesters gathered, heckling the deputies. One protester live-streaming the incident, people heard taunting the wounded deputies. Oh, you die one by one. Tension has been high in South L.A. since sheriff's deputies shot and killed bicyclist Dijon Kizzy on August 31st with nightly protests at the local sheriff's station. In a statement, former Vice President Biden calling the attacks on the deputies absolutely unconscionable. President Trump also weighing in. Our thoughts are with the two sheriff's deputies in Los Angeles who were fighting for their lives when a vicious criminal walked up to their vehicle and shot them at point blank range. And David, the sheriff tells me they are throwing every available resource towards this manhunt. Hundreds of officers, the FBI is also involved, and there is a $100,000 reward for information leading to an arrest. David. All right, Matt Guppin reporting. Matt, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.